Okay, looking at number 15 on the homework, we have the limit as t goes to 0 of 4 to the 2t minus 1 divided by 4 to the t minus 1. Now obviously if you do a direct plug-in, you're going to get 4 to the 0 minus 1 over 4 to the 0 minus 1, which is 4 to the 0 is 1, and so you get the indeterminate form 0 over 0. So um, let's be clever. Let's factor 4 to the 2t minus 1. You have to recognize that as the difference of two squares. You could think of this as 4 to the t minus 1 times 4 to the t plus 1. Because if you FOIL this out now, remember when you multiply and the bases are the same, you add the exponent. So t plus t makes the 2t there. So that was pretty sneaky, recognizing that that's how you would factor that problem. But And then the 4 to the t minus 1's cancel, and so now you have just the limit as t goes to 0, 4 to the t plus 1, and when you plug 0 in for t, you get 1. So this is 4 to the 0 plus 1, which is 1 plus 1, or 2. So that one was just real cute, um, kind of having to recognize that 4 to the 2t is actually a perfect square. It's 4t quantity squared. Okay?